Howdy, folks! How y'all doing out there? You're back with Big Cheesy for another episode of Mass Effect 2 Legendary Edition. Today's episode, we are focusing on a little bit of a companion hunt down, I guess is the best way of putting it. So, in Mass Effect, you have this, okay? You have emails, you have messages that come through, okay? I've read all of mine once, we've got stuff from Anderson, about Zaid, we've got all sorts of bits and pieces about DLC characters and stuff like that, right? So I want to focus on these first because building up loyalty from your characters is a thing that you kind of have to focus on very early on in order to get to the end game with a lot of loyalty from them. And my first character, my first, my favorite character is Jack, okay? No last name known. Exceptional bio ability, no uh, criminal background currently in custody. Jack is rumored to be the most powerful human biotic ever encountered. Very little additional data regarding Jack is available, except that the subject has a history of violence and should be approached carefully. Currently, Jack is being held on the Torian prison ship, Purgatory. Subroach has negotiated for the prisoner's release. We are going to be heading to this one first, okay? I cannot remember for the life of me, because that literally saved the game real quick. I cannot remember for the life of me if I really have to be at a higher karma level or something like that before I go to these ones. Um, but the thing I want to do first is like get started on getting her, okay? I love Jax's character. I think she's fantastic. I think she's wonderful. Um, I think I like the way she cut I like the way, I like the way she is. Uh, recruit the professor, recruit the veteran. What's that? Where is Purgatory? Fuel Depot. Oh yeah, there's fuel in this game, isn't there? My bad, I forgot all about this. Yeah, so you need fuel, you need probes and stuff, okay, in order to get things done properly. So start scanner, and then, so this is the first one I've done of this, so... Is it there? Oh, Rich, I'm with you! Okay, so I do that. Launching probe. In research projects, platinum is used to upgrade sniper rifles, shotguns, and medical equipment. Okay. I've forgotten all about this stuff. Right, so there. Probe launched. In research projects, palladium is used to upgrade heavy pistols, armor, and cybernetics. Right. There. Launching so I've, I've not played this game in a long in time. Projects, palladium is used to upgrade heavy weapons. So it's been a while since I've done anything weapons. like this. I can't remember everything with this game, really. But... I remember I have to get those um, those uh, metals or resources up to full, I think, for really getting the good stuff in this game. Um, I want to go about there. Obviously, they've got a bit of a head start because of our resources in the last game. Um, there's no point doing it if it's not that high, is the thing. So although these are moving, there we go, there's a spike there. Although these are moving, there's no real point in doing them unless it's a big spike. Like that. And once the scanner results get down to, to poor, that's about when we're going to stop this. I'm not going to do this for every single planet with you guys, obviously, because I, I could do a lot of this on my own. Because it's obviously, some of this stuff is going to seem like about the same sort of thing. So I'm not going to make you sit through every single one like this. But just while I've got one, I just want to do this one with you guys a little bit. I think that's about enough. I don't. Ooh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. There's one there. There, that'll do. I only got one probe left anyway. Moderate. Oh. Yep, yeah, got that. Cool, deplete it. There you go. That's what you want to get down to. You want to get every uh, planet down to about that. Um, I can't buy any probes. Oh, I can buy probes. It's just weirdly shaded. I don't know why. Um, plot mass relay jump. Okay, so there you go. So Omega... Okay, I've forgotten about all of this stuff. Really, I really have. There's a lot of stuff here. Recruit the Master Thief, we've got the Citadel over there, Investigate Project Overlord, we've got Recruit the Veteran, Omega, Recruit the Archangel, Archangel even Professor, Recruit the Convict. Alright, this is what I want to do. So this should be Purgatory over here. And like I said, Jack is my favorite character, so I want to get her nice and early on, because the more you have these characters with you, the better off you'll be. Uh, Prisoner Ship, Purgatory, Recruit the Convict. So Dark with Purgatory. I don't expect this to be as... I'm going to cycle a minute. Do that, because I like that appearance. Um, I don't expect this to be as simple as just walk in there and recruit. Um, but if it is, that'd be nice and easy. That should be great. Come on, master, you just get that done right away. Um, okay, your killing intent is ever-present. Increasing weapon damage and storm speed and giving you a damage bonus. Okay, health plus 8%. Weapon damage plus 15. 
I would probably rather have plus that one. I'd rather have that, Shock Trooper. Extra health, weapon damage is good and everything, but the Paragon and Renegade is a big bonus right away there. So we're gonna go with that one. Um, power full. Evolve any power. Okay, cool. Oh, so all of these can be upgraded to full and then evolved. Oh, that's cool, that's good. Uh, let's go with this one. Um, we're gonna keep the two points and do it on her later on. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna keep that as it is for now. That's good, we're happy with that. Um, I don't care about weapon with because I don't have any other weapons right now, so I don't need to worry about that. Um, but now, let's just get in there and get Jax on the team. He looks a little bit pissed. I'm just going to say that. He doesn't look happy to see us, does he? I honestly don't remember any of these missions, though. I, I barely remember the last mission of this game. Barely. In that I know what I have to... Do. Welcome to the Purgatory, Shepard. Your package is being prepped and you can claim it shortly. Thank you. As this is a high security vessel, you'll need to relinquish your weapons before we proceed. What? No. I can't do that. Everyone stand down. Commander, I'm Warden Kiro, and this is my ship. The weapons will be returned on the way out. You must realize this is just a standard procedure. I don't believe you. It's my standard procedure to keep my gun. Let them proceed. Our facility is more than secure enough to handle three armed guests. We're bringing Jack out of cryo. As soon as the funds clear, you can be on your way. If you'll follow me to outprocess- I don't trust this one. Let's go. I very much wouldn't mind popping him in the head right now. Cell block two. As you can see, we keep tight control over the population. Are they just all in cryostasis? prisoner's cell is a self-contained modular unit. I've blown a few out the airlocks as an example. That's nice of you. The ship is made up of 30 cell blocks identical to this one. We house thousands of criminals. We can put the whole place Sounds in so proud of that, doesn't he? Notice. Nothing goes wrong here. Okay. Can you tell me about Jack? Cerberus hasn't told you. Jack is the meanest handful of violence and hate I've ever encountered. <laughs> Dangerous, crazy, and very powerful. I love Jack. You'll see soon enough. How'd you end up running this ship? I was in law enforcement on Palavin and got sick of seeing criminals escape out into the galaxy to carry on with their crimes. Bounty hunters aren't dependable. Eventually, I hit upon this idea. Keep the criminals in space and the galaxy is a safer place. You do this because you think it's necessary? Every day I see the worst sapient life has to offer. Governments are soft. On... Someone had to stand up and make the galaxy safe. I don't disagree with that. Maintaining a population this size in space can't be cheap. We can cut corners that governments can't. And each prisoner brings in a fee from his home world. These individuals what? are violent. And their home planets pay well to keep them here. Oh, cool. What happens if the home world doesn't want we to We explain pay? that we can't maintain the prisoner without their help. So we'll be forced to release him back onto his homeworld. Ha! Ah, very, very good. Well done. Time. So it's an extortion racket. You don't have to agree with my methods, but don't question my motives. These are despicable people, and I'm keeping. Let's them get on with this. Have you had any escape attempts? Jack. We're in space. Million times. They have nowhere to go, and they know it. But still, we exercise extreme caution. These are dangerous individuals. <laughs> <laughs> we have many ways to control the population. If you don't behave yourself, I'm gonna separate I'm you. I'm going to confirm that the funds from Cerberus cleared. Our processing is straight down this hallway. Just keep going past the interrogation rooms and the Supermax wing. I'll catch up with you later, Shepard. I don't like that tone he's got. You know what I'm saying? It just doesn't feel right. It feels like he's just gonna try and ghost us or blow us out of the airlock or something. You seen this shit? Dude, that's not right. Is there something I can do for you? Is this necessary? There's no excuse for beating a prisoner who can't fight back. This is a massage compared to what his victims went through. This degrades you as much as him. We have orders. 
You're not important enough to make your own decisions? I admit, I sometimes get tired of this. Does this really get us anything useful? Stop this. For your own sake. Yeah, you're right. Call it off. At least for now. Thank God for that. That was ridiculous. Hey guys, over here. If you're buying prisoners, can you buy me? Man, I, I don't care where you take me or what you do to me. It's gotta We're be here for Jack. Jack? Forget what I just said. I don't want to go I nowhere. Go. Wish I could go. Jack's going with Sorry, you. Sorry, I keep pressing the wrong button. My bad. Jack's going with you. I'm staying. I thought this ship was a prison, not a market. Sometimes people buy cons so they can do some warden sells as to whoever can pay enough. What do you mean about Jack? Tell me more about Jack. The worst trouble you ever saw, mixed with some crazy, and that's all I'm saying. I should go. Wish I could. Yeah, go. for me, like Jack's is kind of my romantic entanglement. <laughs> um. And the thing is, like, if you get her early on, then it's a bit more trouble than it's worth, really. But she is incredibly loyal at times, okay? And more so for game three as well. Um, this is the supermax wing. It's off limits. Now processing it's back down the hall on your right. Thank you. Bring your package there after the cryothaw's finished. Mate, my package can survive a cryothaw just fine. Thank you very much. Um, but this is, this is going to be great. This is cool. Processing through the door. If that is not perfect for firing, then I don't know what is. I mean, duck and cover right there. You know what I'm saying? My apologies, Shepard. You're more valuable as a prisoner than a customer. I knew it. Drop your weapons and proceed into this open cell. You will not be harmed. You talked up your noble intentions with this prison, but it turns out you're a criminal like the rest. Activate systems. Let's go, bro. Like I said, like I said. What did I get renegade for? For calling him a criminal. What did I get renegade for calling him a criminal. Is that what I got it for? Because that is bullcrap. Actually, bull crap. What else was I supposed to call it? Uh oh. Thank you. Crap. Thank you. Like Super Max Wing, right? Theoretically, I'm guessing. I'm guessing here. Okay. Uh, overload, please overload. I need to get yeah, tuck away a little bit. I feel like I feel like maybe I shouldn't have come here yet. I feel like I'm supposed to do a couple of missions first before I come here because I don't feel like my weapons are anywhere near powerful enough or my armor or anything like that. So. I think this might be the last, I might, ooh. I think I might try and, um, and do some more other side missions and bits and pieces before I kind of do this again. Maybe, I don't know, we'll see. Control. Every door on the cell block opens. It's the only way to get Jack out of cryo. I'm doing it. Be ready. Let's go. All criminals shall go free. Pardon by Executive Cheesy. <laughs> is that Jack? Oh, that is Jack. Hi, Jack. How you doing, sweetie? Oh, this is the best. This is the absolute best. Freaking badass. Freaking badass, come on. Come on, show off. Show off all the toys you got. Damn. Why? She can handle it on her own. Warning. Warning. Sounds like 
and she just blasted a hole through the thing. Of course she did. How exactly are we going to explain to her that we are the ones who saved her when she just blew her way through? Don't kill Jack. Why not kill Jack? I thought you were happy enough to kill everybody pretty much. Damn. Is that her fault? Is that her doing? Did Jack just smash out the life support? I feel like it. I'm not to go down there. Why, why am I not going to be able to go down there? Oh, so the bridge, my bad. Okay, fair enough, sorry. Oh, crap, it's him. Uh, okay, we're going to have to get across the bridge and just hope someone fires at the thing first. Because I've not got any heavy ammo for the women. Overload, overload, overload. Have I got? I do have heavy ammo. My bad. You're gonna just. Are you gonna do? Just keep doing that. Are you? Are you gonna just keep gonna do that. Ow! That wasn't very nice, was it? Now. Okay, I helped. I really. I did help with that one. I mean, didn't get a kill shot on the thing, but I did help. Um. Oh my god, I love Jax. Like, the amount of destruction she's wreaking around here is impressive, to say the least. Improvised weapons. He never had a chance. Okay, high PDA. Four and a half grand. I don't know what this one is. Uh. What? What? Go. Um, um, no, that, yes, that's one, okay, then that one, and then, um, I missed it, didn't I? I, I missed it, I missed it, I know I missed it, it's that one, it's that one, beautiful, and then this one, cracking, okay, I learned that quick enough, I think, I think I did alright on that one, four and a half grand, that's not too bad, all right, we're, we're doing alright, Jesus Christ, okay, we're doing okay, um, let's go get on with this then, I guess. That's a cool one though, that is a weird, I, I forgot that that was a thing, frankly. Um, yeah, let's take Med Jack. Get yeah, four and a half grand just left on him loosely. Not even hacking. Oh, bye. Right. Uh, no, get down the thing, get down the thing. Sniper. Only 10 shots on Cypher. Gotcha. Thank you. Appreciate that. Got some helpful stuff there, Jacob. Thank you, mate. I don't know if that's Jacob, actually. He is, he, to be fair, he is a biohack, so maybe. I mean, I know Miranda hit a boat by way, so maybe. Okay, hi. Uh, you dead? You are pretty much dead. Yeah, Jacob got him. Um, you, come in here. I got no aim on that guy. Got you. Ooh, oh crap. Got you. Ah, oh, crap. Crap, 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 crap. I got more ammo than that, though. Dudes, you're gonna have to move, I think. Yep, you're gonna have to move. Overload. Okay, move away, pull back. Um, do this and do unity. Do the freaking unity, mate. Why are you not doing the heels? Just do the heels, bro. Seriously, why was he not doing the heels? It wasn't. It wasn't just me, was it? It just. It wasn't doing the heels. I'm saying something broken. Something is broken in this game. Um, oh, for the love of God, you just sod off and let me heal my team up for a second. 
You are not switching to incendiary. Well, I'm toasting my ass. Seriously, this is ridiculously powerful. I mean, right, I know I'm doing headshots most of the time on them anyway, but like, damn. All guards. Is there someone alive up here or not? So I just want to make sure I'm not missing anything, basically. Now we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Yes. Yeah, so, okay. All right, guys. Who is your favorite DLC character from out of uh, Mass Effect? Obviously, like, we, we all have our classics that we love, like Rex and Garrus and stuff like that, but who are the ones that were added later on, do you feel like, you know, has really added a lot to the game? Gotcha. Kicking ass, baby. Dude, you didn't even give that guy a chance, did you? You're valuable, Shepard. I could have sold you and lived like a king. And instead, you're gonna die you're like a criminal trouble. warlord. At least I can recapture Jack. Not happening. You're a two-bit slave trader, and I don't have time for it. I do the hard things civil governments are unwilling to. This is for the good of the galaxy. Taking me prisoner is for the good of the galaxy. Let's let's be honest here, bro. Let's be honest. Right, you're getting a big payday out of this. So let's be straight about it, shall we? Okay, that guy took a bullet for you. Oh, come on. You got barely any shield around your face. Where are you? You're up there. Is that you? Yeah, it is you. I see you. Not sure how much health he's got, but it's enough that it's a bit worrying. I've got no more ammo for that gun. Make 20 enemies scream as they fall or are set on fire. Okay. I didn't realize I got that, but okay, I'm happy enough to take it. Stop. Is she taking my shit? Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't even think about it. situation and I'm gonna get you out of here shit you sound like a pussy <laughs> I'm not going anywhere with you you're Cerberus be my enemy is unhealthy I'm tempted I think it might push me there a bit I'm offering to be your friend you don't want to be my enemy they have a way of ending up dead you show up in a Cerberus frigate to take me away somewhere you think I'm stupid this ship is going down in flames we can get you to safety, and we're asking for your help. We could just knock her out and take her. I'd like to see you try. We're not gonna attack her. Good move. Look, you want me to come with you? Make it worth my while. 
Join my team and I'll do what I can for you. Don't make promises you can't keep. I don't. I bet your ship's got lots of Cerberus databases. I want to look at those files, see what Cerberus has got on me. You want me on your team? Let me go through those databases. I'll give you full access. Shepard, you're not authorized to do that. Oh, it upsets the cheerleader even better. You better be straight up with me. Yes, ma'am. So why the hell are we standing here? Move out. Yeah, again, you can see why. I hope you can see why. The attitude, everything like that is just kick ass. I uh, meant to take some steps against Blue Suns to demonstrate consequences of interference. Okay, good shout, good shout. Uh, the convict, though, is now on my team. Um, I do have to do a lot to get her really on my side, though. Okay, she does have issues with me. Um, Welcome to the Normandy, Jack. I'm Miranda, Shepard's second in command. On this ship, we follow orders. Tell the Cerberus cheerleader to back off, Shepard. I'm here because of our deal. Miranda will let you into the system. Let me know what you find. Hear that, Precious? We're going to be friends. You, me, and every embarrassing little secret. I'll be reading down in the hold, or somewhere near the bottom. I don't like a lot of through traffic. Keep your people off me. Better that way. I know you don't approve of that, Miranda, but you have to be done. I'm, I think that's one of the things, really, I should have got an extra character for so Miranda didn't come with me. Because I'm pretty sure I just ticked her off a lot. Um, but anyway, right, I am going to end that episode right there, okay? Like, I want to kind of keep these nice um, and, you know, nicely broken up, I guess is the best way of putting it. But Jax is an awesome character who I love. I adore her, her side missions, her... Um, Loyalty missions and stuff like that. They're very cool. She takes a lot of effort, unfortunately, to get to know and for, and for her to trust me. Um, but eventually, she does kind of fall for the character that I go for uh, playing in this game, like the Paragon. Although she kind of calls it, you know, pussy and whatever at first, she does warm up to it quite a lot. Hey. Hey. Tell me about you, Jack. I'm still finding out about me. Thanks for letting me look at these files. If they're helping you, that's good enough for me. Don't be my buddy. You need me to kill for you, I need you for these files. Let's leave it there. Your friends at Cerberus are into some nasty things. I'm gonna find something I can use. I just know it. What's your history with Cerberus? They raised me in a research facility. I escaped when I was a kid. Been on the run ever since. Oh. They've been chasing me ever since. But soon, I'm gonna chase them. You think about this a lot, don't you? I go to sleep with this. I wake up with it. Everyone I kill, I pretend it's the ones that did this to me. You don't have to live in this pit, you know. It's dark, quiet, and hard to find. That spells safety to me. You know, this ship is a powerhouse. You could go pirate. Live like a king. I could help. You'd be my first mate. Hmm. I'd lead the boarding party and handle the executions. What is it about killing that fascinates you so much? I figure every time someone dies and it's not me, my chances of survival go up. I mean, that's good logic. <laughs> what is it about killing I that fascinates you? I figure simple. I should go. Yep. Yeah, it's the problem really is like talking to Jax does give you a fair bit of renegade. In order to get her on side, you need to take a fair chunk of renegade points as well. Um, it, because some of the things you have to say, you have to demonstrate strength with Jack. Um, but to get her to be the character that I want to be, it does take a lot of effort. And I will get that stuff done. Um, in the meantime, I need to get work on my power girl stuff before I can kind of really build into that. So we are into this episode right here. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. It's the first of a lot of companion missions that we're going to be doing together. Um, like I said, I want to get a load, all my companions kind of in now so we can build things up 
together with them we can bring the right people who, who you got to bring along on certain missions and um, we can start building up the trust and loyalty and also the sooner we kind of get these people on our side the sooner we can kind of get onto the loyalty stuff and for the very end mission of this game that is very important that we get onto as soon as possible but like i said i hope you guys have enjoyed this one if you haven't please check some cheddar on that live and for me subscribe if you haven't already and hit that bell so you don't miss a minute of cheddar action in the meantime though stay happy stay positive stay cheesy out there folks and i will see you again very soon bye bye